Good evening, everyone, and thank you for tuning in to this edition of Reporter's Notebook. I am joined by Miss Kelsey O'Donnell today. Hi, Hello. everyone. Hello. How are you? Good. It's weird being on this side of the chair. Right. Yes, <laughs> exactly. I like it. Um, <laughs> you're in the hot seat now. I yeah, know. so we're asking all the questions. So can you tell us um, what your, it's not a story that you're doing today, but you're, you're doing something kind of special, aren't you? I am. So most people hopefully have heard of Feel Good Friday, but that is going away for just the month of December um, because we came up with this new idea. We have a new digital um for producer, excuse me. Um, his name is Jason Boyd, and he had this awesome idea um, to really boost uh, morale during the holidays. So every Friday night, um, excuse me, every yes, Friday in December, we're going to be going around and featuring locations that have really fun Christmas lights, Christmas decorations. It's called Friday Night Christmas Lights. So. We came up with the idea because I absolutely love sports. I'm a sports reporter, if those of you watching didn't know. Um, so I liked the aspect of Friday night lights and we kind of had a play on words and added in Christmas. So it's Friday night Christmas lights. So I've already aired and did a few interviews for our first one. Um, the first segment will be airing on December 4th and it will be every Friday up until Christmas, which falls on a Friday this year. So it is something really exciting. It's um, going to be here in Eastern North Carolina. That way it is places that you all can go visit, drive through or walk around. And so what are some of the hot spots? What, what was the first place that you, you said you went ahead and you actually shot um, something for the special? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I don't want to spoil it yet, okay. but I can tell you that our first one is at a specific home um, okay. in New Bern. And the, the reason I found this is because I found professional holiday light decorators, which I have never even heard of it. I thought wow. it was such a cool idea. So they walked me through the way they put things up, why they do it, the whole nine yards um, here in Eastern North Carolina. So besides the holiday lights, are there gonna be any other um, parts of the series that, that people can look forward to? Is it locations? Is it, can you can you give me a little bit more detail yeah, about so yeah, yeah. Every Friday is when I'm going to have the aired segment of wherever I was to feature where you can go. Mm -hmm. But we're also going to have an additional site on our website where you can either submit your photos, submit videos of your own home, other homes that you love in the area. That way you can share. And the good part about this is once you submit those photos, you have a chance to also be featured on our newscast, whether it be after weather or we'll pull a few of those photos just to feature, hey, this is so-and-so from Greenville or this is so-and-so from Jacksonville um, showing your Christmas lights just to kind of spread some holiday cheer. All right, I am looking forward to it because I am in desperate need of holiday cheer. I hey, am. My Christmas tree has been up for the past two weeks. So. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I, me too. I'm excited about all this. I feel like with everything going on, everyone is kind of reaching towards um, the holiday cheer and the lights and everything. Mm -hmm. And I, I think I might head out to Newburn just to get some of that holiday spirit. So, yeah. Well, thank you so much for, for joining me. And I look forward to seeing the, the series. Oh, well, thank you. Thanks for having me. All right. Bye, everyone.